All right, hello everyone. Um, I'm sure that you all know that there is some winter weather warnings out there right now. Um, so we'll see what how that all plays out. But I wanted to start by um, sharing this picture that Leanne posted on Facebook this weekend. And it's definitely worth reminding each other that we have a lot of power. Our influence is not just on our students, but also on our colleagues and everyone around us. Um, we have been working with our kiddos on having a positive mindset and telling themselves that they can do hard things. So um, I think it's appropriate that that message also applies to us too. We have a great team and I just want everyone to know that um, if you are feeling stressed out or frustrated by something, lean on somebody that's nearby. Um, this post from Leanne says, the kind of teacher you will become is directly related to the kind of teacher you associate with. Teaching is a profession where misery does more than just love company. It recruits it, seduces it, and romances it. Avoid people who are unhappy and disgruntled about the possibilities of transforming education. They are the enemy of the spirit of the teacher. And luckily for us, we have an awesome superintendent leader who is definitely all about transforming education and possibilities. So be open-minded, be positive, seek out those around you who are positive also. All right, that's my little soapbox for the day. Um, here's our important info. School mall packets were in mailboxes last week. Um, the PTA would like our students to bring those back as soon as possible. Uh, we would like the majority of them back tomorrow. And if you want you can show this video clip to your kids so that they can win prizes. Um, they can see the prizes that they can win, I mean. Jeans this week, remember that you can wear jeans every day this week for any monetary donation. We are hoping to raise some money for a Head Start colleague in Deckerville who is battling cancer. Um, they've told me that she's run out of sick days and so any money that we can raise will go to her to help with the, her expenses. You can bring your money to the office and we will keep a collection envelope and it is just on your own honor to do that. PD Thursday, we will meet on Thursday after the students leave at 1135. Our meeting time will start at 1230 in the library at the elementary. Um, Kurt will head over to the high school for special education training. The agenda is linked there and should pull up. My computer's pretty slow at home. <clears throat> um, the next item is like I said, we have some winter weather heading our way. So please make sure that I have your cell phone number so that in the event of a snow day, I can text you as soon as I know um, the status of our building. My phone number is 810-404-0744. If you're not sure if I have your number, just shoot me a text with your name. Um, that way I have it for uh, potentially even tomorrow. Classroom security. I just wanted to share that a few teachers have noticed that it seems as though someone had been in their rooms after hours. Things had been taken down or moved. Um, since we have a lot of Chromebooks that are not in lockable carts, and I don't know that we always lock the Chromebook carts every afternoon, let's start by locking our classroom doors when you leave. We have sport teams that come and practice here and that creates some traffic in the building. So lock your doors, that way hopefully your items will be more secure. Um, I'll let Pete know that I've asked you to do that um, because that will be a little bit different for him. Um, also winter gear, please try your best to remember to take boots out of the hallway at the end of the day. If you can do a quick boot check at the end of the day for your room, it saves Mr. Doug time when he uses the floor scrubber the next morning. Thank you for helping him with that. Otherwise it takes him quite a bit of time to put all the boots in, bring all the boots back out, that kind of thing. Marking period two stations. Thank you for being flexible Friday. We did have to change up a little bit because we had a huge demand for animals. So we split animals into two groups and Mr. Pathak is doing agriculture solo on his own. The other change is that mindfulness with Mrs. Thompson and Mrs. Porter is in the music room because they would like to use the carpeted room. Um, the iReady webinar, if you didn't sign up for that, you can register for that here. That's on November 21st at 3 p.m. And then also observations. I've just about finished the first round. I should have sent you feedback after your observation. Make sure that you reply to me with answers to any of the questions or noticings and wonderings that I posed on your feedback. So please try to do that. Um, here are the upcoming events. This week we have a school board meeting Monday at 6 at the high school. And then Thursday obviously is a half day for students. We'll dismiss 1135. Teachers, it's a half day for us, but half day of PD. Friday, there is no school. And then we come back Monday to picture retakes. 
Um, and that's it. We do have elementary palm practice on Thursday, the half day from 1135 until 1245. All right, let's have a great week.